Welcome to Dancing with the Stars. I'm Tom Bergeron. And I'm Samantha Harris. With last week's scores so tight tonight, our stars will try to free themselves from the pack on the sexiest night of competition, Latin night. So let's begin the pack freeing and bring out our star. Let's get started. Last week, Baz Luhrmann, Academy Award nominee for Moulin Rouge, said our first star recovered well from a stumble at the start of his quick step. Get set as he gets ready to rumba. It's Iron <laughs> Plus, will Tom DeLay's injury prevent him from dancing? Here goes for the ultimate sizzle. You'll see Chuck and Anna's dance after this. And the pressure's on for Aaron to keep his scores high, but will he struggle with his rumba? Two surprise dancers will have to tune in to find The man who last week was hailed by the judges for being in command of his performance before being warned that now he's got a lot to live up to. Pop star Aaron Carter and his partner, Karina Smirnoff. Last week, Aaron's charismatic quick step ignited Bruno's excitement. Spectacular, spectacular! But also came with a warning. The danger is, though, you have to live up to this. Karina and I are on the top of the pack. We have everything to lose, so we can't get too confident, and we really have to focus on our next dance. Okay, rumba is a very romantic, sexy dance. Like, what do you want me to do, like, up well, here? It depends how, you know, how you are when you're sexy. You think the stare is sexy? Yeah. Do a, do a sexy stare. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta work on this thing. <laughs> two, three, four, you're overdoing it, overdoing it. Leave some room for imagination. And two, three, straight legs and don't look down. Aaron is a performer, so he's used to acting, but he really needs to feel the rumble before it to be believable. And hip, hip, you're overdoing it. You're overdoing it. Good, good, continue and go. <gasps> yeah, that wasn't as good. There's no audience, there's no judges. It's just us dancing intimately, privately together, but then we're like in this bubble and people are gonna just see that. Beautiful. Tonight, I need to make sure that I don't overperform. This rumba has gotta come straight from the heart. Dancing the rumba, Aaron Carter and his partner, Karina Smirna. Let's start with Bruno this time. Plenty of attack, plenty of focus, plenty of determination, but it lacked a little bit of fluidity for me. You know, you went from one thing to the other, I'm not like you were doing hip hop, and that you have to bring it around in the rumba. It needs a little bit more light and shade. 
Okay. Do you understand? Yes. All right. Carrie Ann? Yeah, Aaron, you, you move beautifully. Your lines are gorgeous, but what's happening is you are over-exaggerating everything. Karina is right. You need to listen to her, and you need to just tone it back yeah. a little bit. But still, you did a great job. It was very <laughs> sexy. Well done. Well, I mean, I'm, it lacks musicality, and I think a part of it is from your arms. If, if, you, if you watch it back, you'll see you're just flinging them, and your arms, make, your arms made up of joints, shoulder, elbow, wrist, and hand, and that's what... Yeah, that's you, it. Yeah, yeah. No, not too much of that no. at the end. <laughs> just that. But it was all... Ooh, ooh, and it, it lacked all the music. I'm getting my own back on... Uh, <laughs> just lack musicality. All right, all right, guys, there you go. Scores away backstage. <laughs> Tonight, when you're voting for your favorites at ABC.com, check out our new fan feedback feature. There you can upload video, talk back to our judges. Oh, I got to see this. And our stars, too, and have a chance to see yourself on TV. Samantha? All right, thanks, Tom. Get on over here, Aaron. Now, the last two weeks, you guys were at the top of the judges' leaderboard, a fantastic place to be, a little bit of a mixed bag there. Were you disappointed to hear what they had to say tonight? It's true. So uh, I'm just going to have to listen to it and apply it to the next dance. And apparently listen to Karina, too, they say. <laughs> you like that. You got a little smirk on your face when they told him to listen to you. But he does. Aaron does listen to me all the time, and that's why he's trying something new, something different every single rehearsal. So I think he did a great job. I'm proud of him. This is a very, it's a very difficult dance, and hats off to everybody doing it, so. And she did tell you to feel it, not act it, so were you feeling it out there? I felt <laughs> it. I was a little nervous, though, for this one, so. <laughs> a little bit nervous? A little bit nervous for this one, so. I don't, did you feel like you saw the nerves? Um, I think we were both nervous, because we <laughs> saw, you know, Len giving out fives only. <laughs> <laughs> All right, all right. Well, listen, folks, do not move an inch because we are going to get Aaron and Karina's scores and find out if Tom DeLay will actually be able to dance tonight in exactly 60 seconds. Let's get their scores. Ladies and gentlemen, the judges' scores. Carrie Ann Inaba. Eight. Len Goodman. Six. Bruno Tomioli. Seven. A little all over the place there, but at 21. It's my age. Does <laughs> <laughs> that, that just make you happy, or is that all right? Uh, you got to grow. You got to grow. All right, good wisdom. Yeah. I love it. 21 out of 30. It may only be week three, but you know how this works. You vote for your favorites, because then they might stay in the competition. Tom. All right, Samantha, now it is time to find out what's happening with Tom DeLay. Last week, the uh, pre-stress fracture led to a shaky finish to his dance. He managed to not only hang on to Cheryl, but also to his place in the competition despite tying for the bottom of the judges' leaderboard. It's former House Majority Leader... For Natalie and Alec, call 1-800-868-3413. For Chuck and Anna, call 1-800-868-3402. For Aaron and Karina, call 1-800-868-3401. For Joanna and Derek, call 1 800 868 3415. For Kelly and Louie, call 1 800 868 3416. All of our stars want your votes. Here's how the judges have ranked them this week. At the top of the leaderboard are Maya and Dimitri with 27, and at the bottom are Michael and Anna with 14. All right, Queen Latifah joins us on our results show tomorrow night, right now on Castle. It's Fashion Week in New York, and it's a tough week for one young model. That starts now.